Alright, let's pick it up here. We didn't go through this door yet, primarily because there's the strong presence, and I assume it's going to be another mini-boss. Wait, it's almost sunrise? Oh, crap. What have we do been doing all this time? Uh, these enemies we can actually deal with. Um, okay. I'm going to analyze flowers. I s crap. Should have guessed. Unfortunately, you know, I got this extra turn for uh, Gale, so we can just pull off this attack. Physical attacks are actually they're pretty much worthless against uh, Flowers, if you haven't noticed. Uh, especially with his skills, a uh, Death Touch, or no, a Death Blow. Oh no. Okay, Ice is out of the question. Hit this thing. Let's see if I can electrocute it. Maybe it'll do me some good. Yeah, he's back and just as annoying as ever. And you'll see him get a lot worse. Okay. Because I think that um, the original Digital Devil Saga uh, Midhogger is actually much easier than the uh, than the one here. Okay. So we still got some ways to go. I was actually kind of backtracking a little bit, especially going through every single door just to see if I missed anything. Hopefully to see if there's any extra rings. But at this point I found pretty much most of them. Except for the ones that I didn't get uh, as carryovers from the original Digital Devil Saga, i.e. the Amala right here. Because I didn't try to beat Hitoshira. Okay, physical attacks, useless. There's nothing we can really do. Now let's see if I can use... And as you can see, nothing. Yeah. Because in the case of the actual in Nidhogger and uh, the original Digital Devil Saga, if you remember, he he can basically punch him. In this case, no. Okay. That was not a door. I don't know why I went there. Okay, so we got a wait. There's a stairway here. Looks like the way I have to go. Oh wait, there's an item behind there. Let's see if I can go around that. Oh. Go away, Nidhogger. Go away. Obviously, that's never gonna happen. And if you see me abuse combos, well, that's basically um, what they're there for. Obviously, I know that Ice is going to be ineffective after experiencing him when he did the last time. Okay. So, down this stairway, there should be a rare item. It's that glowing yellow thing. Let's see what's inside. That's a weird name for a flower, let's see what it says. The Flower of Heaven? I think this is probably going to be the, uh, the flower that will give us the most uh, bang for a buck once we sell it. I don't know if there's going to be a shop on the sun, I don't think there would, would be it. See if we can do some electrocution with this. Whew! Lucky death. Okay, good. Uh, it's kind of risky because I didn't know Ma uh, I removed Madoon from Sarah. So let's see. Forgot there's a combo from Mama Doom. This. Learn 
Watch carefully, because this is what you're not supposed to do. Because the critical isn't exactly doing much damage, and retaliation damage is much more, so it's not worth my time or effort. Which also means something else from the beginning of the game. Ex uh, basically, going through weaknesses in Berserk form is pretty much a load of crap. Because otherwise, it would have done about as much damage to Floss as it would have done for any other enemy. And what the hell? Why is that blocked? Okay. So the only reason that it didn't, that the uh, critical wasn't kill like it was last time, uh, I was in berserk form, is because obviously it has a uh, incredible resistance to physical attacks. Which is kind of obvious. Let's see what's in here. Rare item. Gimme. Oh no, fight. Oh no, florals. Ow. Okay. His weakness I actually discovered is basically the same as every other uh, physical attack demon. You'll see. There's more uh, ailments as far as weaknesses are concerned. Okay, I thought someone got cursed. Okay, let's just go with Mizandai. I assume fire is going to be ineffective though. Because I think uh, Floros in uh, Persona 3 was fire based. Okay. Moving on, we have to go this way from the looks of it. Oh, I love this enemy! Why? He's freaking weak to electricity. Let's see. Uh, I would analyze it, but uh, just the hell with this. You're going down. Okay. I remember Mott is weak to uh, electricity in Nocturne. However, he is not weak to ailments. And I don't think Expel and Death works either. Let's see. Force is useless, apparently. So it's not a bad idea to use that. Okay, Gale leveled up. Alright, we're gonna keep moving forward, or as far as we're gonna keep going. Hello! Another Karma Terminal. Nobody learned their mantra yet, so... I'm just gonna save here. And basically, since we're running out of time in this video, I'm gonna actually wrap this up here, and I'll see you later.